Today we're going to take a walk down the Schuylkill River Trail. When the hurricane came through, all of this was flooded. This whole area. But today is a beautiful day. So this right here is the Schuylkill River. I like to call it Schuylkill Punch. That's what I grew up on. <laughs> All right, let's go. I took the South Street entrance. There's different entrances to this trail throughout the city. It connects. So I'm starting in the South. South Philly side. See runners, walkers, bikers, and people just strolling. It's a nice trail. Let's see how far we can get. I'm hoping to make it all the way to the art museum. So that's a few miles from here. So the trail actually starts from like around here. We're gonna see the actual beginning. All this is residue. This is all residue from, from the hurricane. All of this was underwater. That's crazy. That's not the norm here, Philly. So this is the actual start to the bank. So as the sign says, it's being built in segments. You can see people go fishing, biking, walking, running. It's a pretty cool trail and it's long, so you can get a nice workout in and you have nice views of the city. Graffiti, of course, that's city life. So let's go. Starting from the Started from the beginning. Try to stay on my side of the road. 
makes it easier. But all of this, all of this was underwater. I, like that is so crazy to me. So right there, that's the South Street ramp. So like, if you don't feel like taking the steps, you can't take the steps like we did. The stair, um, you can just come down this ramp and it throws you right on. Like I said, there's a lot of entrances throughout. But from here, look at that. Look at the city, the city view. Over there's like 30th Street Station. And then on that side, that's that center city. Street Bridge. So that would be the South Philly side. And you take the bridge, and it'll take you to West Philly. But then you take this ramp down, and you end up right on the banks. the art museum so let's keep going here you see a little more action Like there was some damage here from the hurricane. I'm not sure that landed there or that was there. I don't know. There's another entrance, the Walnut Street entrance. That's 76. Looks like it's a memorial. Wow, I didn't know this was here. It was taken from the World Trade Center. I didn't know this was here. nice and shiny up there <laughs> I guess that's the work they were doing so I think we can make it all the way
stuff and that kind of stuff. But hey, looks like fun. to trail. We just passed the Market Street entrance and to me Market Street kind of is the lifeline that separates north and south. So now you can say we're heading towards the north side of the city. All oh, from the storm. And this is a new giant uh, food store. And I saw on the news that that, that right there, all that up there, that was all flooded. Like the people that live all the way up there, they were stuck, they couldn't come down. in the art museum back there. ways to go. There's more damage from the storm. Look at all the mud. It's been a week since the storm. I feel like the city did a pretty good job trying to get this cleaned up because this is a very popular trail. It's not 100% but it's doable. Something I never really took notice of. They have a rain garden here. It's just off to the side from the main road, the main trail. Kind of just little spot to just chill that's pretty cool let's get back Be careful with the bikers We reached the skate park. So let's take a quick loop around. Today was the first Eagles game. My son just told me they won. So go Eagles. Here's the skate. Skate park. Pretty cool. It's an area for them.
from trash to treasure. So all the sewers emptied into the school hall. Ew. So we reached the side of the art museum. We're actually gonna go behind it. Like if we wanted to, we could have jumped right there on Martin Luther King Drive and then walk or people drive, or people uh, ride their bikes and stuff on the side. But we're going to stay on the trail. So imagine all of this being underwater. muddy, all of that, underwater. So we've reached the Waterworks Historic Area. And all this is, we're behind the art museum. looks like a nice little cute little park South Garden Wow 1829 There's a marble fountain I think I know where it's at I'll show you guys 1830. Here's that fountain, but it's not on. Pretty dirty. I mean, it was underwater, so. Frederick Grapp, he's the one that designed Waterworks, which is right over here. It's a restaurant slash banquet hall, I believe. I've never been, but I've heard they have weddings and all that. When I first saw this, <laughs> this statue, tell me in the comments, who do you think he resembles to me anyway? Look at that, can't go down. Mm -hmm. Normally can you can just walk this trail all the way over and you're just a little closer to the water, but not today. This sounds like a party boot. I think we could go up that way. We go all the way up. We're gonna try it guys, it's very steep.
trying to get better at narrating, guys. Still new to this YouTube game. But I appreciate it if you're still watching. Well, we got played. Can't get there. Womp womp. Skated off. Here's the view from this thing from Martin Luther King. I'll take these steps up because you know, why not? Here, Mr. Softy. If that's not a summer sound, I don't know what is. museum right there you usually see the front side of the well actually it's the part that you actually see the most where the rocky statue is that's actually the back side of the art museum but for some reason it gets so much photography i guess and more hype that everyone thinks that's the front but it's not that's the back This is the front of the art museum. Which faces the river. But this is the front of the art museum. pictures and the videos you see of the steps where everybody runs up like Rocky, that's the back. That's the back of the museum. But this is the front. So now we're gonna head into uncharted territory for myself. I've never been on this side. Here 
you get a different view. So that's the gazebo that we were in. And now we're on the other side. So it's just a little boardwalk that kind of just loops around. So I just walked around like that and ended up over here. So I have a little story. Two minutes ago, an older lady passed out so when I see things like that I can't just walk away so I just stayed around a family member called 911 and they were asking for exact address like that's hard like we are in the middle of, you know like it's it's just hard to give like an exact address anyway um they made it they're here right now and the guy that was just um singing that I just showed He's the one that was able to give us an exact address. So <laughs> kudos to him because now they're here and they're taking care of us. William Rush. America's first sculptor. So that's it. We walked the entire trail from South Philly down to the art museum. Honestly, don't know how long it took me because I kept stopping uh, to record. <laughs> um, it's a, about a three mile three mile walk so however long it takes you to do three miles that's how long it would take you from South Philly from the entrance that we came in at to the art museum that's not too bad a lot of things going on you see a lot of people if you're you know if you're nosy like me and like to see what's going on around the city <laughs> hope you guys like this video give it a thumbs up if you haven't and uh See you in the next one. Bye.